In the late 1800s, Guccio Gucci, a young teenager from Florence, was working hard as a hotel attendant in Paris and then later in London. As he worked, he became extremely impressed with the luxurious luggage that a lot of the guests would bring with them. He became so inspired that he actually visited the London manufacturer H.J. Cave and Sons and then went back to Florence in order to start his own leather goods store. When he returned home in 1906, he opened up the House of Gucci, which was actually a saddlery shop. Then in 1920, he started selling leather bags to horsemen and then started selling luxurious luggage as times progressed and there were horseless carriages. Then they expanded to make shoes and their famous loafers with the horse bit on it, silks and other type of apparel. But during World War II, there was a major shortage of materials such as leather and they began to use cotton canvas. They even used bamboo for one of their bags, which became so popular that they still sell it today. The brand became really well known and synonymous with Italian fashion as celebrities all around the world would travel to Florence in order to get Gucci products. And in 1953, Guccio Gucci passed away and his sons continued the business and expanded to New York. But during the 1990s, Gucci went through the most difficult time in the company's history and nearly went bankrupt. One of the sons and the head of Gucci, Marizo Gucci, was actually killed by a hitman who was hired by his ex-wife. Then the luxury brand was being tarnished by cheap counterfeits around the world. So in order to restore the company's luxurious brand, Gucci hired American designer Tom Ford as the artistic director where he worked for 11 years. Gucci products were reduced and the company's headquarters moved back to Florence. And today, Ford is credited with saving the company. Now the Gucci brand is worth nearly $15 billion and is owned by the parent fashion conglomerate, Caring. And that's how Gucci started. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram at Austin Daniel Petri.